Hi Aries, it's L here to do your love short reading. So it's going to be a short reading for love. Um, if it resonates for you, like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Um, let's go ahead and jump into this Aries. Thank you, Lord God, for blessing Aries with a clear, concise message from you. Okay, Aries, let's see what's going on for you uh, this week in love. Okay, so we got the Nine of Swords. All right, so someone could be up in their head about you or you up in your head about them. The Nine of Pentacles, it looks like somebody's living their best life here, um, relying on themselves, putting energy, time, effort into themselves. It talks about the single woman who keeps relationships outside of her home, outside of her heart space. She doesn't have time for intimacy right now. She is just focusing on her, maybe even her business or business aspirations. The devil card, it says that somebody is obsessed um, and deep uh, thought and deep obsession, infatuation with the connection with you, maybe even sexually, um, someone is uh, overthinking, overdoing it. Uh, they felt like they made the wrong choice here. The Ace of Pentacles, someone wants to come back to you, have a new start here, wants to solidify their relationship, possibly by way of sex here. The Queen of Swords coming out says that um, maybe you're not having it. You're not taking to this. You don't want this type of energy. Um, you're asking for truth and clarity. You're also cutting something or someone off. The Seven of Pentacles, it looks like there's a period of instability. Well, inactivity in terms of you and this person, there hasn't been a lot of activity or maybe even talking. Um, it seems as if you're frustrated with how things have gone thus far, and maybe they are too. It looks like you or the other person or it's mutual. You guys want to see it through to the end, whatever the end is. But there is a period of no activity happening here due to the fact of frustration. On the four swords, yeah, you guys could definitely be on a temporary break. Um, that's what it looks like here. The page of pentacles wanting to start again. It looks like you guys have had a lot of false starts and no progression, cutting off and then coming back together. Um, the, the queen of pentacles, it looks like somebody's focused on themselves, nurturing themselves, queen of wands. Lots of either there has been several different women in terms of a connection or there are at least two or three women here and one man here uh the emperor coming up and this could be you aries um somebody has obligation to more than one woman too especially if they have children with another child um there could be a new child on the way there could be someone pregnant um it seems as if there is someone else in this energy another woman there's the main woman and then there's another woman here uh the will of fortune it looks like Somebody feels like this is destined or this is a destined connection, but it's failure to pull the trigger on it because they, they understand that they can't go any further than where they've gone with this person. They can't really provide anything other than maybe the five of pentacles. Um, they can't provide anything real or sure or stable. All they can provide is instability because their heart or their obligation is somewhere else. The two knights here says that maybe you could be dealing with someone from your past. Here, the king of cups. This is somebody who wants a new start with you. Someone who feels left out in the cold. Someone who feels like they have been neglected, ignored by you or vice versa. This is how you feel. Yes, yeah, somebody from your past wants a new start here. They did not give you the ring or the, the wand or the, the, the crown. They did not crown you. They didn't choose you. But now it looks like they want to come back towards you with some big major gesture. Ten of Pentacles here. This person still could be married or in some relationship. And they want the relationship that they had with you. They want that back. The status quo with you though. Whatever the relationship was back then, that's what they want with you right now. They don't want anything to change. They're not asking for change. They're not asking for growth and progression. But they're asking for the relationship back. Because it brought them a lot of harmony, a lot of peace um, a lot of celebration okay um, and they want to start this up again again it feels as if you guys could have had a lot of stop and start a lot of um, breaking up and getting back together here the ten of cups it seems as if um, they have something real with the ten of pentacles here with someone else and with you is the ten of cups here um, it hasn't been realized it is emotional it's whimsical at best there is room for realization um, but it's about how you guys play this out 
the eight of cups yeah it looks like somebody wants to walk back towards you heal this connection they come to some realization that maybe they didn't treat you right maybe how they felt about the connection wasn't right um they want to do something for you or or give something to you here they want to have more stability in this connection lots of kings coming up here you could be dealing with a boss type energy also this person wants to reconcile with you you have a lot of men vying for your attention here um yeah you may have a lot of people wanting to date you uh you have somebody significant that um wants to come back to the advice for you is the three of pentacles um three of pentacles if you do come back with somebody you have to do something you have to build something together you have to make some major turning point in the relationship okay the the three of pentacles specifically talks about doing something tangible i don't know starting a business moving in together buying a house i don't know buying a dog i don't know but you have to do something that solidifies and holds the relationship together that's the somebody feels like you're the one that got away okay um they could be they could want to be a bachelor they could also be married or coupled how they want to act with you is no strings attached but strings attached this shit is stupid um if you feel like this resonates for you go over to the website book your own reading there ask a question or two by texting it to the number below you can also donate to the channel by clicking the buy me a coffee link thank you aries many blessings to you take care